We just completed all the hut rush. Time to rip some packs. Let's get into it. Another week, another hot rush. Hopefully this one's better than, I guess, two week spans for hot rushes, not one week, but you know what I mean. Last time, we got nothing, like absolutely nothing, so we're hoping to beat that today. I seen someone on Twitter from this pack, one gold player, not even an 80 plus guaranteed, get a 94 team of the week. And we got Cole in. <laughs> so our goal today is to try and beat 94 overall. Probably not going to happen, but would be nice. Mini packs... Uh, our best mini pack this year was actually a purple 89 Gibson. I have not even seen an 80 from one since then, I don't think, but <laughs> there's always the chance. I think we have one more. I'm just going to open that right now, actually get it out the way instead of building up anticipation for a mini pack. But obviously anything, I was going to say any gold from a mini pack would be nice, but we didn't even get that. So whatever. Anyway, because why would I not? And our guaranteed two gold players are a 74 and a 80. <laughs> I guess we're starting somewhere. Uh, nothing there. Yeah, the hot rush this week wasn't terribly bad to grind. You, sometimes it's just like actually a horrible experience. And other times it just kind of goes smooth. Today was, or this one was smooth. But uh, obviously it's not exactly the most fun of all time to sit down for four hours and play hot rush. But you just got to do it sometimes. I am expecting nothing. <laughs> I don't know what else to say, really. I mean, obviously not the most exciting packs ever. Save that for tomorrow. With our rival rewards, but, um, yeah. That was a base pack, alright. Just actually guaranteed 80 player. Could it be a 96? It could be an 82. And an 85? Okay. Interesting. Not a bad start. Already better than last week, I think. Maybe we got an 85? But I don't even think so. I think it was terrible. Four gold players. I'll never forget we got X-Factor Crosby from one of these. That'll forever be the best hot rush pull we get, I think. Unless they want to prove me wrong, but they didn't there. Another base pack. Is this one going to top the other one? I don't think it's going to be very hard to top the other one. It did! Another 82. And another gold player. Slowly building the collection. Hey, a thousand coins. Take a thousand coins all day long. Another four gold player pack. And this one has Huska Fortu Fortunato. <laughs> Sorry, what a name. And Zaitsev. 80 plus guaranteed. I am hoping the 85 isn't the best, but obviously, hey, 280s at least again. Not exactly the best. Not exactly the best rewards, but they are rewards. <laughs> more, more glow players. Any good ones? Spencer Martin. Wenberg. Another 80. 81. I mean, we're getting stuff. This is going to help for rerolls, I guess. There's one way to look at it. Premium packs. Like, I'm starting to say, I think we're literally the people that probably opened the most premium packs in the game. Not a fact, but it's my headcanon. I'm pretty sure it's got to be up there. 81 Jack Hughes from premium pack. Obviously not going to complain too much about it, but maybe just a little. Another 80 plus guaranteed. We have three gold players. Um, 82 Tyler... F Huffoli. 84 Dowdy. Okay, we're getting stuff. Nothing crazy good for March. It's March, so at this rate, even an 86 isn't that exciting. An 87 kind of is for Master Set collectible purposes. I mean, 5 is a decent amount, but I don't know. 80. I almost said 84. Speaking is hard. 4 gold players again. Redmond and an 81. Another 80 plus guaranteed. This is as good as it gets here, pretty much. And it's just Clayton Kelly. It's a purple! It's a 91 to Brink at! Okay. I will take that from my rush all day. All day. It's not better than a 94. But it's pretty dang close. If I'm going to be honest, he is definitely just getting turned into collectibles for the next event. So I'm not going to use him. But maybe I'll try him. I can try him at least one game. Well, okay. So so that was, that was very exciting. That is our best heart rush pull of the year. I think, well, I feel like X-Factor Crosby is technically pretty hard to beat, but that's definitely our best not X-Factor pull. Uh, we're going to save the ones with 80 pluses for last, so four gold players. Vladislav Smeed. And Veroni, or Verono. The last one that doesn't have any 80 pluses guaranteed. I mean, we peaked, let's be real. There's nothing else that we can do to beat that. I mean, there is, but what are the odds it's going to happen? Franz Nielsen. Yeah, guaranteed at least 180 in every pack. I know 180 isn't exactly juicy. 
Oh, the 180 is a 81 Will Butcher. I think I want to open the player's pack first before these ones, honestly, because it's realistically worse. I don't know about pack odds, but it's definitely a worse pack overall. And our 180 is Appleton, so we're not guaranteed anything. 81, another 80. I mean, it's paying out more than it needed to. Some silvers, which will help fit the bonus round. Another 80. I mean, just building our rerolls, I guess. Or team builders. I don't, I need to make the team builders to get one of the 98s, but I just don't want to. I literally, I literally just don't want to, and it's going to bite me in the butt, but I don't really feel like it. So I'm just personally having more fun doing rerolls because I'm a pack fiend, as they say. And not only a, f a pack fiend, a free-to-play pack fiend. Anyway, letting in, Miko letting in. There's 280 pluses in here, and they're both the last cards. Can we get another purple? No, and no. 83 to bring cat. Well, we got all the to bring cat. So right now, minus the X factor, we have reached the final pack. But all these, we have a bonus round. All these gonna have a bonus round, especially for Hot Rush. 280 pluses, still yet to be seen. 81 Giordano for the second time, and 82 Timo Meyer. Last card from Hot Rush. Doesn't matter. It was a dub. A 91 from Hot Rush. Automatic dub. You're here with the bonus round. Always fun time. 82 plus pack. Gold reroll. And then three. Yeah, three silver rerolls. So we're going to get those out of the way. I mean, we can't really top what we did. Let's be honest. It's not going to happen. I'd like surprises. If I had to choose one of the Master Set players to pull, it would definitely be Kane. So I chose not to make him. I probably should have, but I didn't really feel like I needed him. So I'm going to hold out for next event and hope there's something there. And with all the collectibles I had saved up, I just made my Riley 96. Because why not? And our silver rerolls, obviously not good. Now, the question is, can our gold reroll be better than the silver rerolls? Spoiler alert, it automatically is. 82 Gensel. And another 80. So way better. Okay, I believe the last pack of the video. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure this is going to be it. 82 plus guarantee. We have had terrible luck with these lately. We finally... Well, you're actually going to start with Gensel, who we got from the gold reroll. Are you serious? You didn't even give me a chance to hype you up. It's going to say we've been having bad luck with it. But we broke it with a 92 Ekblad. Ah, uh, this one's already over. The 82 plus pack is an 82 Gensel that we just got from a gold reroll. That is... Uh, that's a yikes, but it's fine. We won today, in my opinion. Also, people have probably been wondering why my inbox is always full. I just have these hut champ points that I can't use because it's always full and I can't send them to my collection either it's kind of annoying see full send they're just stuck there they're stuck there in limbo for eternity but it's fine thank you everybody so much for watching hope you enjoyed I'll catch you in the next one peace out